Hi, I'm Austin Zimmerman, Product Specialist with Houston Metal Sign. In those 50 years of being in the industry, if it's something we've learned is that stainless steel is one of the hardest materials to cut. It even rivals some of the exotic high nickel based alloys. Stainless steel is used in just about every walk of life from the aerospace to automotive industry and is used in most cooking utensils in the food industry. It can come in just about any shape or size. So in particular, this stainless here is a 316 stainless, eight inch round with a thin wall. Provided by sawbladedata.com, we are to be able to cut this part at about four to five square inches a minute. Uh, not having too much total square inches to cut in this material, it actually would take us normally under a minute to cut, but we are limited to head fall rate, which is the rate at which the bandsaw will actually let us wide open cut through the material. So in a real world situation, we're only actually gonna be able to cut this part in about three minutes. We're going to be using our Velox 560 machine. It's got a two inch blade with a 22 inch capacity. And the blade that we're going to be using is the Q1002 carbide triple chip blade from sawblade.com. The Q1002 is a good general purpose workhorse blade that's got a good sturdy carbide on it that's going to give us great life and precision when cutting such an abrasive material as stainless steel. You can get yours if you're in the industry through sawblade.com. They're fast, affordable, and you can have same day shipping. Now that we've got our blade in our machine, we just need to designate what stainless we're actually using. Stainless ranges from really abrasive to gummy, so you'll have a wide variety of possible feet per minute on the blade speed. So if it's a real abrasive material, you might be running somewhere from 70 to 90 feet per minute, or if it's a gummy material, you could be running from 100 to 180 feet per minute. What's also gonna aid us in the cutting process is the use of cutting fluid. Especially in such an abrasive material, you're gonna want good lubricators to keep the heat and the chip away from the material and the blade. So we're gonna be using sawblade.com's C5200 semi-synthetic sawing fluid. The C5200 is a great all-around coolant that is heavy duty and industrial for the uses in a high production situation like Houston Metal Sawing. It's got good lubricators, a good detergent package, and it's gonna keep the blade and the material cool during the cutting process. Another key aspect to the whole cutting process is the use of a chip brush. It's a pretty simple part, but makes a huge difference in the efficiency and the cut life of your blade. We have a high performance sawblade.com chip brush installed on this 560 here that's gonna keep the chips evacuated out of that gullet. That way when the blade comes back around, you're not carrying chips back into the cut. Finally, with the use of sawblade.com's quality industrial guides, we're gonna be able to stay precise and efficient keeping that blade walking directly through that material right where we want it, keeping a nice tight tolerance on this customer's parts. Here at Houston Metal Sawing, we change our guides once, twice, maybe even three times a year. That way we keep up with the efficiency and the quality demand that our customers deserve. If you're in the industry and you're looking for an industrial set of carbide guides, all you gotta do is log on to sawblade.com where we carry a variety for many major manufacturers. Sawbladedata.com is a great engine to use no matter whether you're in a small home shot trying to make sure you keep up with the efficiency and the life of your blade and your machine, or you're in a high production situation such as Houston Metal Sawing, Sawbladedata.com is going to give you a good baseline to start all your cutting processes. Houston Metal Sawing has been in the industry for over 50 years and we have over 15 horizontal and vertical bandsaws with a wide range of capacity from 3 8 all the way up to 5 foot in cut diameter and we can handle materials from 2 pounds all the way up to 25 tons. So whether you have a simple or complex job or you're having some issues in some stainless materials, reach out to HoustonMetalSawing.com and request a quote.